all of our premium press themes come with lots of different payment gateways built in, allowing you to accept payments for products and services that you sell on your premium press website. To set up any of the payment options, simply log into the admin area of your website and click on the Payments tab within your Premium Press admin options. Each of the payment gateways you set up requires you to first create an account with that payment merchant website. So for example, if you wish to take payments via PayPal, you must first create an account with PayPal. If you wish to accept payments via WorldPay, you must first create an account with WorldPay. Once you have created an account with that merchant, there will be specific data provided by that merchant that you would then enter into the admin area of your Premium Press team. For example, in PayPal, we would require our PayPal email account. So here you would enter your PayPal email. To set up any of the merchant's options, you simply click on the edit option here. And then fill in the details provided. In the case of PayPal standards, to set up this gateway, we will simply enable it from the option drop down menu here, enter our PayPal email address, and then set up the return, cancel, and notify links. Now we recommend that these links all are the same. However, we have separated them in case you wish to customize the return and cancel links. But it is important that they all return to a callback page, which is a specific page template that's provided when you've purchased a premium pristine. To set up a callback page, you would simply create a new page in the admin area of your WordPress website under the Pages option. So you would create a new page, you would give it a name callback, and then on the left hand side, under the page attributes, you would select the template callback. When you save this page, you will be given a permalink, which is the link to the page that you wish, to, which is set up for this callback template. So you would simply copy that permalink, then go back to your payments page, click on edit, and for the return, cancel, and notify option, you would copy and paste that link into that box. The currency code allows you to customize what currency you wish to take payments in. And for PayPal, there are a lot of different currencies. But for example, USD would be obviously taking payments in the United States dollar. We could put Great British Pound, which is GBP, and so on and so forth. And you can get these currency code options via the PayPal website. The display name here allows you to customize the, the display name on the checkout page. So for example, we have Pay Now with PayPal, and you can obviously change that to, ch to display something else. And you can even set up your own custom display icon, which is an icon that will also just be displayed on the payment page um, next to the text which says Pay Now with PayPal. And it's the same for each and every one of these payment gateways. And the great thing about premium press products is that you can accept more than one payment option at the same time. So you could display payment from PayPal, WorldPay, and even Google Checkout, all at the checkout page, giving your visitors an option to choose what's mo most suitable for them.